Hi guys, in this video I will show you how to install and set up and what you can do with uh, Mini 2 Partition Wizard 3. Uh, this is the latest uh, version uh, for this year. Uh, this is uh, free tools for uh, editing your partition on your hard drive or SSD drive. This is a setup screen, first setup screen, go to next, license agreement, next where you want to install this version this is version 9 next next create desktop icon next install now we have icon on desktop launch you can close this window Oh, new future launch application. Now we got main menu. This is how the software looks. Very nice, very modern, and very logic. Uh, first, you will notice that uh, this uh, new version is a little bit. Uh, have uh, very little changes in uh, layout the main changes are in more beautiful colors and in some uh, redesigned uh, icons uh, what you have on uh, what are the options in uh, this software this software is very powerful and have plenty of options uh, you have this main menu up here and also you have many actions you can make with icons the same tools are from the left and this is menu where you have your partitions where you can edit for example precise this is menu graphical menu where you edit your partitions and on this menu you in on in this window you can see uh, the drives you have connected to your pc i like this software because like you can see i have linux installed on my uh, pc and uh, with x4 file system like you see he see my ssd drive with no problems with x4 uh, linux swap x4 no problems also for windows ntfs fat everything this is usb attached on my pc everything is recognized very well you have these textual commands you can reload your drives view disk commands, options, partitions and so on this what you have is the main commands when you are doing something I will show you later with these icons here this is very nice feature to have bootable, bootable CD I already downloaded it if you go you will go this icon will link you to partition vision uh, partition uh, to mini tool website where you can download this so i i have already downloaded i will later show you what you can do with this okay and this is uh, upgrade to to pro version and so on contact help fuck and so on I like this part of user interface because it's very you have uh, graphic iconography when you see your drives I like because I like this because here I have I attached a USB drive my USB stick this is actually SSD on 
USB adapter and like you can see icon for USB okay now I will show you what, what you can really do with this software for example you have buy uh, some uh, used hard drive for example this will be my drive one you go to these buttons from the left select your drive first thing you want to do is delete all partitions okay yes you go to apply or to undo if you are sure what you are doing go to apply it's very fast software now we will select again right click you can create surface test you test it's very nice feature when you buy new hard drive or use the hard drive always go to surface test test it will show you if you have some bad or weak se sectors on your hard drive okay we will stop for now this close the window oh. A uh, nice feature is this wipe partition. Why is uh, this nice uh, feature? Because if you sell to someone your uh, hard drive or SSD drive uh, with this software, you can erase your uh, data and be sure that will no one will cannot recover your data uh, for him. If you want to be absolutely sure that date, your data will be erased, go to this and it will be very slow but your data will be destroyed. Okay, for now like I say you buy, uh, use it, uh, hard drive and you want to make some partition. If you want to be your data storage, go to create, choose logical partition choose your drive letter you want to have file system and go to ok now go if you are satisfied with the result don't be confused with this unlocated space this unlocated space is here to show to your operating system or to your motherboard that this is not a bootable drive apply ok Like you can see, it's very fast, very, really very fast, fast software. For example, if you want to later go to uh, to have another partition here, go to here it is move or reset resize. For example, like this. If you are satisfied, go to apply. If you are not, to undo. Now you can create when with this command we create free space for new partition. Create new partition, logical file system. Go to apply. Some software make this one megabyte free space between partitions, some software do not make. In this case, we, you have, but this is really, uh, really not big deal because this is just one, one megabyte of, of free space. For two megabytes for, for whole drive, this is really, really uh, small amount of data. Okay, uh, if you want, you have this. Uh, icons here the, where almost uh, the same fun functions have when you go to right click but if you want to merge you have option merge you will be surprised because this option is not available in free version you will go to merge select your partition you want to merge for example here merge this function is not supported by mini tool okay you have 
a bootable CD, but do not have merge options. You will must to buy this software for this option. Some other software offer you this for free, but do not offer bootable CD and so on. Okay, now we want to uh, to format to erase this all uh, partitions. For example, uh, when you buy new drive, what uh, partition table that will have? It will have similar like this. Select your drive, delete, go to left, delete all partition. Are you sure? Yes. Apply. Okay. If you want to make first partition to be your uh, partition when, when where will be installed your operating system we will go to create not to logical but to primary with this slider you can adjust the size of this partition go to apply okay don't be confused again I do not know why this software leave this one megabyte software I do not think that will be any problems at all primary Set active apply active. This is my end boot system. This will show you my Windows operating system. Like you see on my my Windows installed, I do not have this one megabyte free partition, but I, I really do not know why this software leave this. I do not believe that we will be ha have any problems with booting or installing this operating system on this partition, but I really do not know why this leave. It's okay for uh, logical partitions, but but with primary, I do not know. Okay, now we'll go to fill this free space with new partition. This is secondary, logical. Okay. And now we have primary secondary partition again leaving this one megabyte unlocked space. If believe me this is not big deal but some software leave this one megabyte uh, partition some software do not leave. All in all you have plenty of option on this uh, with this uh, software it's a uh, really nice software uh, plenty of option for free software uh, you go you can go to hide partition like you see undo and so on so on you have plenty of option it's nice nice software it's free and you have bootable cd for if your uh, operating system is down you can go and try to recover some partition with this bootable cd or you can if you do not have operating system at all you can on some pc or or notebook you can make partition with this software with this bootable cd and uh, to prepare your new uh, laptop or PC for for uh, new installation of operating system, I will recommend to all of you to install this software on your PC or in your Windows operating system. It's very nice to have. Uh, you can always always have control on your partitions, and it's very nice because you always can check your hilt of your of your partitions so with this function function 
uh, surface test uh, test my my recommendation to you to make this test one in the month and all in all it's very nice uh, software it's very easy to install do not uh, will will not uh, use your system system resource uh, very much it's light in easy to use very easy to use graphical interface is good and I with my uh, experience with this software it's very safe uh, to use it because will not make anything without you